This is first time in Moscow? Yes, it's first time. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, it is our first time. Yeah, first time. Hopefully not the last. We love it. Uh, my partner here has been a three times. Three times. Three times. What did you do here? Business, little bit business with wood. I am to my business in Saudi Arabia. After finish from my business, after I come to okay. uh, Russia. Was it difficult to come here? How many hours was the flight? Three, three hours. Three hours. Three hours from Brazil? I oh, know. Oh, no. Uh, 16 hours. For 16. Was it difficult? No, no more. Yeah, I mean, you know, we, we live in South America. It's very hard, very difficult. We had to take uh, two cities uh, before we came to Russia, Amsterdam, and we've been in Zurich. Um, two transit stops. Yeah, two transit stops. So how many hours? Yeah, ooh, about two days flying. Two days flying. Yeah, but we did it because we love soccer. Yeah, we live in now in Lisbon. Uh, your, our flight is seven hours. Seven hours. So it was easy. Yeah, it's easy. Oh, uh, what? Uh, Twenty hours? Yes. Yeah. So was it difficult to come here? It was really difficult. Yeah. Oh, really? Yeah, yes. What was the most difficult part? Actually, I live in Japan. So from Japan, I went to Korea. In Korea, I stayed like twelve hours, and then I came here. It was a long time. Oh yeah, it's very difficult. I live in Lima, uh, the Lima to go to the Canada, and then Madrid, and then Istanbul uh, from here. When did you come? Three days ago. We uh, arrived in Moscow uh, yesterday. Now we we are go to Red Square, but photos so every time. Our flight leaves to, tomorrow. I mean today at night. We already check out and we are ready to go. Like in about an hour, we are leaving to the airport. To Peru? Yes. Well, no, to Japan. I'll go to Japan. Uh, I go to La Madrid. Why did you come here? <laughs> I actually won tickets to come here through a sweepstakes in America, and we're super excited. We got here last night. So you, you like uh, soccer in the United States? Yeah, yeah we like cool. soccer. Yeah. Yeah, we're sad that the United States isn't in it, but it's still like the biggest event in the world. But, so. they, but did they participate? They didn't qualify. Yeah. <laughs> We're sad. Yeah, We're sad, but it's still okay. This is an amazing experience. Yeah, but I've heard that uh, they have all these uh, uh, soccer schools around the United States. In each uh, schoolyard, people are playing soccer. It becomes more yeah. and more popular. So yeah. they are expecting you to become champions in like in 20 or 30 years. What do you think about it? We love that. Yeah, I think we hope so. Maybe for 2026, when the World Cup's there, we'll be ready. Maybe we'll be in it when we actually have it in the United States. We'll see. But we are preparing, I feel like, more now. What did you expect uh, before coming here? I don't know. I guess I expected it to not be this big, like Moscow. I didn't realize how many people lived here. We did that before, and we had no idea. It was 12 million. Correct me if I'm wrong. Officially. Million. Officially, yeah. that live here. We had no idea it was going to yeah. be this big. The party in Russians. The party in a Russian party, like Robbie Williams yes. sing. Good, so good. A lot more hostility, and it doesn't. E it's not here. Hostility doesn't exist in Russia. We we'll expect uh, parties, uh, good people, good atmosphere, good positive energy from the, all the people in the, from different kind of nation. And uh, I think it's very, very nice and very good. And, this. Uh, <laughs> yeah, a lot of party, a lot of party. We thought that it was going to be really cold. We expect a lot of vodka, a little bit vodka, and Brazil going to make their World Cup. <laughs> I expected a lot of culture and, I, and probably more police, more police, but we haven't seen that. We have been really surprised, really surprised how open this is, uh, this square. So much first, uh, man, smile, his photos, and that happen. It's a, it's a party, World War party, so I, I, I don't uh, expect uh, so many things, but now this is amazing. I, I, my, the, this, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> but did you know something about Russia? Uh, before, no. I've been reading a little bit about Russia. I know it was uh, 20 years ago was completely different, but uh, with all respect, I, I love the way that it looks like right now because of the uh, socialism, communism. I respect that, but uh, this way of living, 
I think people is enjoying more, they have more opportunities, they have more access to money, which is good for education, to make a better living. So I think uh, Russia is uh, heading the right path. And you know what's the best part about it? That uh, they kept the good things about 20 years ago, about religion, about um, respect, so many things that are good that they are applying the right way in order to go up and keep growing. Uh, something about Stalin, something about Lenin. <laughs> did you saw him? Yeah. Or did you see Lenin? Yeah, it was did you see Lenin? No, no, not yet. Because he's not so, far yeah. from here. Yeah, yeah. We're gonna make the third, third, uh, three days uh, since today. So we are gonna take three days. So it's one of my dreams is visit the Lenin and drink some coke. So the capitalism win. <laughs> and also, uh, I expect to see a Volga cars and all cars. And uh, really, bro, I, I find that uh, that that I hear in front of me, I see an Audi store, I see BMWs, uh, I see McDonald's, Kentucky Fried Chicken. I think this is an open country right now. It's beautiful, and it's 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 a good job choice to the FIFA to to make the world champion here. Yeah. You you got it, you got it true. I really like that you have find uh, so many differences. Yeah. But have you seen Lenin? No, I yeah, have seen Lenin in it was a big line. It was like 30 minutes to get in, so we decided to go around, and then we complete. We forgot about it. We we end up here, but uh, we're gonna stay here for a few more days. So, if you have the opportunity, we would like to go there. But it's, it was a 30 minutes lane in the middle of the sun, so we we have a different choice. So, and I think it's good because you have uh, it's history, like all the country in the world. Yeah, but I heard from uh, other English fans that uh, newspapers uh, wrote that it's quite dangerous here. Yeah, yeah but that's, that's not the case. Yeah, and uh, we have only 2,000 uh, fans from England yes. this year. I know, yeah. That's a shame. That's and just... usually it's like uh, 40, yeah. 40,000. Yeah, because we have, we'd have all the songs. We would be dancing in this square. And, but it's good. We've met loads of other people, loads of nice fans, Tunisian fans. They were, they were brilliant for us. Yeah, 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 yeah. there's the whole thing about political uh, things, but it's, it's, you know, people should come here, they should experience the country in Russia, and it's beautiful. And there's, there's of course, difference between what the Western media is writing about Russia and what the Russian media are writing about Russia. So, yeah, sure. so, 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 so. People uh, yeah. see the difference. Yeah. One, two, one, jump!